I had a local vert ramp called uh, Fisherman's Inn, okay. Chesapeake Ramp, Hell Ramp, all kinds of names for it. It was one of the East Coast's first steel ramps. Hmm. You know, there was there was uh, Texas. Uh-huh. They had the steel ramp there, shut up in skate area. Okay. And then uh, we had one, and it was gnarly. It was like 12 feet high. I think it had like 10 feet of flat, no flat, two feet of vert. Uh-huh. Like it was just I mean, this outdoor insane. in this like outdoor. a field or yeah. type of area. Yeah, and I think I might remember close to the wa- close to the water. Yeah, okay. So rumor had it that these guys were after the demo, which was, think about it. Like you skate a demo, you're gonna go skate a ramp. Like yeah, probably not. That steel twelve foot <laughs> ramp. Right. Ramp, so right. I went there nighttime skating. You know, I was into it. I was uh-huh. skating with all my buddies. They didn't show up, so I was like, oh darn it. Oh well. So the next day, um, we go back and you know just normal session. They show up, you know. I think it's Steve Sayas. Uh, I think Tony was there. Stacy uh-huh. showed up eventually, and yeah. The, I yeah. mean, legends. Yeah, yeah. Right there. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It was gnarly. It was at the time, you know, riding for Skull Skates and stuff, and they were like, "Hey, you know, I, I, I could see doing doing this." You know what I mean? Like after were, just watching you, they just could they could yeah, see it. Yeah, yeah. Wow. It was crazy. I was I was just a little kid with big pads. <laughs> okay, <laughs> yeah. flyaway helmet. Big, How old are we big, talking about? 13. 13 years old. 13, already got, 13, already, getting, 14, already on skull skates and doing 13, your thing. 14, yeah. Okay. Maybe 14. Still? Amazing. Yeah. And then, um, so did you take that as like, wait a minute, is this, what is this guy saying? Am I keep, do, keep doing my oh, thing I, or? I, like I knew what he was talking. He was like, he was like, you could be pro one day, basically. He okay. was like, you need to, you, you know what I mean? He can see me doing this. But not, not like Ride for Powell. Is that Stacey? No, yeah. A ride yeah. for Powell, yeah. That's what, okay. Yeah. That's how you yeah. pr- interpreted that right. comment. Yeah. Interesting. And that right. was Stacy that was saying that? Yeah. At the time, I believe it was Stacy. Uh, I think, I can't remember. It's weird. When you're 12, you don't really remember yeah, yeah, too yeah. much. Or 13. Yeah. I, I, I remember Jesse Martinez, I think. Yes. Maybe Tommy Guerrero, That's Jim Thebos, maybe. Wow. Like wow. Steve Saez. Like, <laughs> I, I want to say Tony was there. I met McGill once. I don't, I don't think Mike was there. Hmm. But it was, it, I'm pretty sure it was Stacy because I remember him soft spoken going, I could see you doing it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know? Bucky, I could see you doing this. Yeah. Okay. Amazing. Okay. So, so they caught, you, you caught their attention at that Yeah. At and that then after that point, ramp. I kept in touch with Todd Hastings, who mm-hmm. was a team manager at the time. Mm-hmm. And literally while I was in Baltimore, he wanted me to call every week and just be like, tell me what you're doing. Like, what tricks have you learned? It was like that gnarly. And Stacy was awesome too. Stacy was like, you know, when I started making money, like, through sponsorships and uh-huh. stuff he was the first person to tell me like save your receipts the Good tax shit. thing like like i've heard stuff that you want to know yeah. i've heard yeah. stuff wow. i've heard uh stories about stacy mm-hmm. doing that mm-hmm. which is awesome because a lot of people don't do that mm-hmm. a lot of sponsors don't give they just say here's your check mm-hmm. yep so that's all, that's especially when you're like fucking 14 years old and you're yeah. getting mm-hmm. paid like really like thank you for the advice because I, mean, yeah. I didn't know that you right know I mean? no, tax totally. man comes you're broke you're like what do you mean wow yeah <laughs> okay I owe all this money. I owe, I owe how much? Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean? It's a shock to the system. Um, so you uh, stayed in, t- in, t- in contact with Paul Hastings. Uh, Todd. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. Todd, um, yeah, Todd Hastings. And then you would have to tell him the tricks that Dude, you were they, doing. Like, who wouldn't be stoked to tell the tricks? You know what I mean? Sure. Like, this sure. is what I'm trying. He's like, all oh, these. You know, another thing Stacy had me do was at the time, I was riding super super tight trucks Mm -hmm. like to the point where they barely turned Mm. he made me loosen up my truck half a turn like once a week or something oh interesting (laughs) he's like once a a week i want you to turn it oh my god this guy's like a doctor dude it worked too (laughs) did it yeah in it worked in the turn in the sense of like you could just you would do better tricks or how i mean what what was a i think it just you know, I, I, the I would, flow I would, of the ramp. Yeah, like I, I would yeah. have better, st- created better style sure. at the time. Yeah, 
I mean, I don't think I really got good style until like a few years ago, actually, because I look back at some some of my old footage and I'm just like, oh my god, it was a sketch. Ah, but we're all nah, our own so, worst critics. No, I, I disagree with you. I think you the, had the six tight, out. Yeah, the tight, yeah, tight yeah, so, back then. Fuck yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was tic tacking everywhere. You know what I mean? Yeah, I, I definitely know what you mean, but I think at that time it was timeless, and your style definitely fit the time. It was. Yeah. You know, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. But it's funny because like that's such like a doctor thing. No, like not really? even not even like loosen your trucks. Mm -hmm. It's just right. like, hey, have a turn mm -hmm. once a week. week. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like, hey, call me in the morning. How would he know to do that? Uh, you know what I mean? It's like, crazy. Set you up process. for success. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. Look it's at you like, now, dude. He did a good job. No, I mean, yeah. my, are you still my doing trucks it? are loose as shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, there you go. Yeah. I actually, I actually just tightened my trucks because I came. This is the board I rode at X Games. This couple weekends ago oh shit and elliot sloan's ramp is freaking humongous and it was hot as shit so i actually tightened my trucks up for the first time oh don't go oh, okay. they whoa, will whoa, whoa, they whoa, will get tell... loosened back up okay okay, still, okay. For Bert, I oh mean, yeah these things are yeah. pretty loose but okay. they're not like i mean don't tell like, you should call up stacy and be like dude i'm still turning my trucks <laughs> half a turn a week i'm almost like, when can i stop <laughs> i'm running out of kingpin my kingpin is like extendo yeah. I, I remember standing on danny ways or uh, some sort of mega ramp board oh that's I, danny I, I i i couldn't even i i you couldn't even move no it's a you boat. couldn't i you couldn't even roll like yeah. you couldn't roll or you would fall over yeah, right yeah i was exactly. like how does that work but is that that's not like do you do anything like no, I mean that's pretty much how my trucks were back then. But mega mega boards are next D level different. tight. It's a whole okay, different, okay. whole different story. Okay. I mean, you're going what fifty miles an hour, you're, pretty you're much. Going you're, 20, you're going between twenty and thirty, I think. Seems like. Oh. I mean, and the last thing you want is speed wells. Ooh. Yeah. Going down. <laughs> yeah. Nope. Uh, so then, what happens? You're, you're telling them these tricks. They're getting excited. Yeah. You're. Yeah. You're. Are you filming anything? Uh, at the time, not really. Okay, no, not until I not until I came out to Tony's house and we started filming. And okay. Yeah, I think when I stay with Steve Saez, that's when we filmed Public Domain. Got you. Yeah. So that was 88. Well, probably 87, 88, yeah. right? Yeah. Um, and then, so before that, was there like a, hey, you're on the team? Oh, yeah, yeah, I was on. Get like, I was on, like, for sure. And that's when that's when Tony got me on Airwalk and Tracker. You know, uh, it kind of came with it, you know. Okay, a little package. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so that was like just word of mouth, basically? Hey, I'm, I'm hook up my homie. Or, pretty, I mean, I mean, pretty, I, or pretty much. I were mean, you skating contests that were like starting to get known, or I skated a couple of contests. My first, I think one of my first contests, I fell dropping in. Like, I <laughs> bailed. I bailed. Yeah, run up to it was Virginia Beach. I bailed on something, and then I run up the ramp and I go to drop in and I slam. Like it's <laughs> it it's also made of fiberglass, which was really weird and slippery. Mm, yeah. Huh. But yeah, I felt it was like the worst experience ever. Jeez. They're like, you get to redo. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Dude, it was, it was so embarrassing. I had this trip out that like that was the way people got sponsored back then. It was just like if someone vouches for you, like, hey, you're, this dude, put him on. Right. You know, that's, that's pretty awesome, dude. Well, I mean, Tony was tight with, you know, Bomb Larry and, mm -hmm. and Ridgeway right. at the time, who was team manager for Tracker. And you're just getting on Pal too. And I'm so just there's, getting there, on there is something yeah, yeah. solid that's big. There. Yeah, yeah. For yeah. Sure. And then at the time, I think it was Sin at Airwalk. Mm-hmm. Okay. So those are, I mean, right off the bat, you got Pal, Tracker, Airwalk. I mean, you're... Yeah. you're those, are the, those are the brands at that time, too. Yep. No doubt. You're chilling. Yeah. Wow. No, I was, I was good. That's amazing. Yeah, I was I was. And you're, what, good. you're 15 years old? Yep. yep. 14, whatever. From that. Baltimore. Yeah. 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 Like, what? Isn't that yeah. funny? Yeah. That, if they never came... To Baltimore and skated that horrible steel ramp. Mm -hmm. What would have happened? I, you would have you would have gone have, on your I, own path for sure. Yeah, but it might have been a lot. It would have been a lot different. A lot yeah. different. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. yeah. It's for so sure. crazy. Mm -hmm. There's no answer to that question, but it's always fun to try to think about. Yep. You know, the, it's it's a timelines. Where where would have I gone? Mm -hmm. What I mean, would have I, happened? I might have fallen on hard time. You know, they're trying to come up. Uh, Where is that like button? Right? Is it right here or right here? Just a little scroll um, coming down the bottom. It's it's subscribe over to yeah. It's on your it's on my left. Right. It's no, on, my on left. your left. Hey, yeah, hit right that there. button right there. Right there. Right there. Yeah, <laughs> the, the like button's kind of like in the in the right middle there. there. It's like we're kind of. Right oh, it's there. like right here. Kind of. Like yeah, right there. The subscribes like over to the left. <laughs> it's like right over there. <laughs> All right.